Hey everybody, Jason here from Grip Tape. I've been putting together some training material on how to install the Grip Tape nodes for Comfy UI and was inspired by the work that Amara was doing and just sort of playing around with different node networks and thought I would show you really quickly uh, just an example of how I created this image of a capybara with a cool sort of background texture. Um, so this uses a couple of Grip Tape nodes and the basic idea is that we start from just some really simple prompts. So this is a grip tape create image from text node. And I just said, hey, create some grungy background wallpaper. And then I'm displaying that image and that's what it creates. Did the same thing down below. I said, create a cute capybara sitting in water, which it did. Then I have some image description nodes where I say, okay, now go ahead and describe the texture of this image in great detail, which is what it does there. I have two nodes connected to the capybara, which is one, describe the environment, so it gets the background, and the other is describe the character in great detail. I then take those three things and I shove them into this merged text node. And what that does is just take the text from the output and just sort of like puts them one after another with a new line after each one. You can just go blah, 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 blah them all together. Then I take that big giant mashup of text and I put it into this grip tape run agent that says, go ahead and create a concise prompt for an image generation engine inspired by this text that's coming in. And so basically any text that comes in here just gets thrown at the end of this thing right here. And then we take all of that and it runs and we get a prompt here. So it says, generate an image featuring a serene capybara, partially submerged in natural body of water, blah, 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 earthy tones, rust, gray, black, hints of green, etc. So we get this prompt right here. We take that, we throw it into this create image from text, and we get our beautiful capybara with some lovely textures. So all together, a very fun and relatively simple workflow to put together. Anyway, have a great day.